Well, the LNP leader says he's greatly offended by Labor's latest campaign tactic in Ashgrove. New ALP election material in the key seat ties Campbell Newman to a North Queensland candidate's controversial comments about rape. Campbell Newman is furious about the latest election salvo in Ashgrove. It's about the LNP's Cairns candidate Gavin King, who once said that women who drink excessively are partly to blame if they're assaulted. An ALP flyer points out that Mr Newman still supports Mr King. That quite clearly is suggesting that I condone rape. Now this is a new low in politics in Queensland. The flyer doesn't say that, but the LNP leader has taken offence. I today call on the Premier to totally repudiate this campaign. I don't believe Gavin King should be a candidate for public office and if Mr Newman doesn't like it then he should withdraw his support for Gavin King. I'm backing Mr King because he's a great family man who knows he said the wrong thing and most importantly has apologised on numerous occasions. Mr Newman is also fending off more claims that his in-laws' property interests benefited from a Brisbane City Council rezoning decision last year when he was still Lord Mayor. I didn't vote on the plan. I had excused myself from both the Civic Cabinet and the full council meeting. This beggars belief and it's taken Queenslanders for mugs. And so the dress rehearsal for the election campaign continues. But as well as mud slinging, there are policies. Campbell Newman says the LNP would reduce property taxes and improve planning laws to support the construction sector. He's also promised a cabinet committee to focus on property issues and more powers for local councils. It is about regulation, ladies and gentlemen. I know it's not sexy, but it's hard work. Uh, what I saw uh, from Campbell Newman today was a couple more slogans uh, without any policy to back it up. Expect more from both sides before Election Day. Chris O'Brien, ABC News.